Uh, yes, sir. It's my first time. Um, I've been to visit, but this is my first time to do the sculpting part. Uh, I have been to, last year I came to the festival. That's where I gained my interest. I wanted to give it a try. Uh, this is my first one uh, in the rock, uh, in the rock carving. Uh, they, they call it sculpting. Um, but me being an auto body repairman, I wanted to try my skills out and see if I had any way of <laughs> seeing depth in being a sculptor or, you know, my creativity, uh, how far it would go. I got a, um, uh, I'm gonna call it a lady facing the east with her hair blowing in the west. <laughs> it's, it's just a, uh, just something I picked out the rock, you know, and really came with a, a clear mind and I wanted the rock to talk to me and that's what I ended up with. Something that was probably a little more advanced than I'm used to because I had never done this before. So I kind of wish I would have done something a little more abstract and carving a face is pretty difficult. So it's coming along though. I plan to take it to the house and try my luck. It's opened another door for me to enjoy my retirement and my shop and uh, test my skills and uh, maybe have something to leave, leave at the end. The, the image of it being not flat, it's in 3D. You have to bring it alive. Um, that's the part, that's probably the hard part for me. I'm, I'm, I'm still seeing a little flat <laughs> and not giving it the, you know, making it real. I mean, making it have depth. That, that's probably the hardest part. Um, other than just getting out here, that's the hard part. A lot of people say they can't. You don't know until you try. You gotta stick your neck out and, and give it a shot. I'm enjoying it. I've learned so much. I think it's going to improve uh, my thought pattern on just watching people around me. I, I'm fully wanting to come back next year. That's for sure. So I'm going to take it home and I'm going to stick with it and see what I end up with.